What is good everybody? It is your boy Cap back with another Xenoverse 2 video for you guys. Today we're going to be going over the newest raid on Xenoverse 2 and also talking about something that was pretty much forgotten about with DLC 14 that Bandai and Dimps never gave us at this point in time and it doesn't look like we'll get probably until the next DLC as it stands right now but getting into this raid first and foremost as you guys can see it will be up against cell and it is a light raid for any light users out there that do watch these kind of videos now getting into the dates of this it'll be from the 18th to the 24th now the rewards for this guys you're going to be getting 50 tp medals for 50, uh, 5k damage at 15k damage you're going to be getting another 50 tp medals along with the fashionable suit the shoes part of it at 30k damage you'll be getting the bottom part of the fashionable suit along a uh, fashionable suit along with a super soul from gohan do not bully your father i believe that one it's supposed to say something along the lines of do not hurt my dad or do not hurt my father something like that um but you guys know that google translations are usually a bit off when it comes to these raids right here now 50k damage you're getting another 50 teeth medals with the top part of the fashionable suit and illustration 134 now the reason i want to cover this raid and cover something else that was basically forgotten with dlc 14 is because they coincide with each other and what i'm talking about guys is a raid that they basically forgot to give us in the Majin Buu Awoken raid. This is a raid that they literally completely forgot to put in this DLC. As you can see right here, if you read this statement on the Dragon Ball official website, it says, in the free update, Goku GT and Majin Buu will appear in the raid boss battle. This is a new type of raid boss battle where the raid bosses are able to transform during the fight. Goku GT will power up into Goku GT Super Saiyan 3 and then into Super Saiyan 4. Take on Goku alongside uh, alongside your friends in increasingly intense battles that feel like you, you're part of the anime. Meanwhile, Majin Buu will change from Majin Buu into Super Buu and then finally Kid Buu. Each time he transforms, he'll unleash even more powerful attacks. So as you can see, they literally promoted this brand new raid that I'm assuming had some brand new rewards along with it. And they never gave us this raid, but instead, they're giving us this nonsense right here with this damn Cell raid that doesn't even feature anything new from DL. DLC 14 like DLC 14 legit came out a month ago there's a ton of stuff that they still have yet to release especially when you talk about the artworks from that DLC so why are we getting a raid like this a month after DLC 14 when you haven't even released all the raids that you promoted with DLC 14 just something that I, I truly don't understand and it's something that kind of bothers me like I don't like when they promote stuff with certain DLCs and then don't put them in that DLC this one is the newest prime example of that and I just do not understand why now I will say they did add in a Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta raid along with the Goku one so they did give us two Awoken raids in a sense but at the same time they clearly promoted that Majin Buu would be a new raid boss or transforming Buu would be a new raid boss in this DLC and we still have yet to get that raid but again instead we're getting these kind of trash raids which just don't make no sense from the standpoint of how they promoted that other one with the Majin Buu and then also there's so many more DLC 14 rewards that they can give us and they give us this kind of nonsense right here so let me know what you guys think about this down below in the comments first and foremost your thoughts on this raid right here and then secondly your thoughts on the simple fact that we still have yet to get that Majin Buu raid even though it was clearly and I mean clearly promoted with this DLC like I said, man, let me know your thoughts on all that down below in the comments. But till next time, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and as always, hope you guys have a good one. Hey, y'all.